guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Courtney if you're new here and today I'm very excited for this video. Today I'm going to be trying the new Maybelline The Falsies Lash Lift Mascara. I love getting away with not wearing lashes if I can. So if I can find a really great mascara that's going to make it look like I have false lashes, I definitely, definitely will do that. I'm going to bring you guys in. Okay. Now that you're all up in my face. So I got the shade uh, Black is Black. Falsies Lash of Mascara with Fiber Delivers, Dramatic Volume and Long Lifted Lashes, a mascara that looks like false eyelashes. Our double curved lifting brush and fiber infused formula grabs lashes at the root to lift, thicken and lengthen. No clumps, no smears or flakes, just volume and the look of longer eyelashes that last all day and it says sweep from root to tip repeat until desired look do not let dry between coats so all that sounds good and dandy let's try it out this is what i do with any mascara so i'm gonna curl them just like i would with any other mascara okay so let's see how this looks Okay, so that's one coat. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a second coat. Um, it's a little clumpier than I would like. It said no clumps. Why you lied to me? Okay, I'm gonna try the other side. I was able to brush out those clumps with an eyebrow brush. So let's try this side. That's one coat. All right. I'm gonna apply the second coat now. I was expecting a little bit more. It is a good mascara. Let me try this one more coat and see how I like it. This is the third coat now. Okay, that's better. Oh yeah, we're getting there guys. Definitely will have to do this quicker because this eye already dried. I can tell and it says, don't let it dry in between coats. So, oh yeah, look at that. Whoa, okay, that's so much better. I like it guys, I'm liking it. I'm gonna try a little bit on the lower lashes. I usually avoid this because I have little to no lashes to begin with, and sometimes it just looks a little sparse and a little weird when I do it, because it just emphasizes the spaces where I don't have lashes. So I'm just gonna try it and see how it looks. It might turn out really bad, just because it's my lashes are just not great on the lower lash line. It really like grabbed onto every little hair underneath. I mean, I'm not a huge fan of this look because it looks kind of like spider legs because I don't have the thickest um, lashes underneath, but if you do have more hair on your, if you have more lashes on your lower lash line, you probably really like this. I'm trying really hard not to get mascara on my face, hence the mascara face I'm making right now. Wow, okay. I did mess up a little bit. I got some on my skin, but mascara does not look like this on my lower lashes, like ever. Okay, so I'm only gonna put one layer on the bottom lashes because I just, I'm not a huge fan of that look, the spider leg look, but this is three coats on the top lashes and one coat on the bottom lashes. Once this, I'm gonna clean up the under eye once it dries down a little. It's not too clumpy. It's a tiny, tiny bit clumpy. Like the milk one is a lot more um, natural looking. If you want to look like you have falsies on without having falsies on, this is the one for you. I feel like my lashes look longer than usual, thicker than usual. Okay, so final thoughts. I love this mascara. This is definitely my new favorite mascara. And I would recommend, again, this is the blackest black. They have a brown black and another black. I don't really know what the difference is between the two blacks, but this one is supposed to be blackest black. I really like it. So this review went really well, and this is my first review of 2020. If you guys do like review videos like this, please give this video a like, and please comment down below some products that you might like me to try. Um, I do purchase things all by myself. I don't get PR. Um, I'm a very small channel, obviously. If you're here, you can see all of that. Yeah, so I would love to hear from you guys. Please comment down below what you think of this mascara. Please subscribe if you would like to see more videos from me and hit that notification bell because next week I'm going to be trying out the new 
Maybelline Urban Cover. Uh, full coverage protective makeup is sunscreen with SPF 50. Very curious. So tune in next week. That will be coming. Be sure to follow me on all my social medias, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, to stay in the know of when I'm going to be posting. I like to post little Instagram stories to let everybody know that a new video is up. So go follow me on my Instagram at Latest Courtney. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Bye guys.